Hello, this is Mr. Chabry, and we are here with the next episode of the Sun, um, Ultra Sun playthrough. So, um, question of the day, who did you choose as your starter? Um, as you can see with my little team preview thing, I chose Rowlet. So, anyway, who did you choose? Go ahead, put that in the comment, and let's hop back into the game. So, oh, Hal's here to, I guess, challenge us or something? Oh, yeah, so we got the Sparkling Stone, which is going to be our Z um, bracelet. Alright, so I guess Hollow wants to borrow our stone. So, I guess that makes sense. I mean, I can't do anything with it as it is. So we're going to let Hala turn it into the bracelet for us. I'm fine with that. Oh, Nebby, quit fooling around. So Nebby's just doing its own thing here. Um, trying to escape. We're here back at the house. All right, and she's going to see our beautiful little Rowlet. Rowlet will get to meet Meowth. All right, so, yep, they're just chatting, I guess. I don't know. But now we're going to, you know, go to the next day, I think. Or maybe that night. Yep, the next day. Oh, so it's sunset. I bet in Ultra Moon it's all the sunrise. Because that that, that that matches like Dusk Mane and Dawn Wings and Cosma. So the doorbell has just rung. And I remember who this is. This is Kakui. If, yep, it's Kakui, just letting himself into the house. Kakui? I don't know you well enough. Alright, so... Alright, Kakui. Where are you leading me there, Kakui? He's up here. That rock rough's not there anymore. And he's going to tell he's going to have us catch some Pokemon. Yeah, give me some Pokeballs. No, he's going to show us first. This is something that in earlier Pokemon games were optional, but for some reason, now you always have to go through this little how to catch tutorial. So, yeah, we're going to go ahead and watch this. Alright, so, yeah, it's basically just Kakui throwing the Pokeball. Um, and there we go. So now give us our Pokeballs. Alright, so... Wants us to go back home to rest? You... What? Why? I just came outside. Um. So is this like a static encounter as well, where it's always the same Pokemon? Maybe. I don't know. I'm not going to catch it though. Um. Still not totally sure who I'm going to fill out on my team. 
But I don't think Vikavolt's going to be that Pokemon. That didn't do much. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and try to defeat this thing. Get some nice experience. But yeah, Vigavolt, you, you you don't get to evolve it until way later in the game. Unless they change something in this one, where you can evolve it earlier, but... Uh, I'll probably just skip on the Vigavolt. Alright, so... Yeah, that Grubbin only went for String Shot, so... Some nice experience. Let me grab this item. All right, we've got another Pokeball. All right, so my character is just. I guess we'll go ahead and battle this girl. This is. This is. Well, let's see what she has. I need to get some experience for my little Rowlet. Plus, I would like to get um, some more ideas of what Pokemon I want to bring onto the team. But Neri are here. Okay, interesting. So, if you want a Lop Honey, they're here. An Ultra Sun. And go ahead and Leafage. We're gonna take a pound. It doesn't do much. All right, so we got some nice experience there. All right, so yeah, that's can't do anything there. Um, battle this guy, I guess. Yeah. Oh, he's got a Caterpie. But Caterpie's his only Pokemon. Youngster Jimmy. Yep, Caterpie. Alright, let me see what I can do. I'll probably just tackle this thing. And it's like level 3, so I'm not too worried about it. about a three hit KO there so we'll just continue tackling it get some nice experience and take the string shot all right so this tackle will take it out still not sure what Pokemon I'd like to use All right, so we are at level eight already. Robin is doing pretty good. And we got Peck too, so that's pretty nice. All right. All right, there was a... Grab, okay. All right, a potion. There was a wingle that flew by. Ooh, that's blocked. That's blocked. Woo! There it wave goodbye, change. What's this? Like What is this? Like Kind of like, you know, I 
All right, so. What's this person? Okay, so I don't know what that really does there. There's like new people here. This person wasn't here earlier, I don't think. So I'm going to just hit it with a leafage. And we get a crit too, nice. Alright, so... Um... Okay, what are these two doing? The Ultra Recon Squad. They're just chilling out here. I don't remember their names. Okay, what's happening here? Interesting. Okay, uh, I don't know what to how to react to that. Ooh, there's an Alolan executor just roaming through here. That is pretty cool. They have really spiffed up the overworld. Alright, so, I want to see what's going on over here. Anything? People talking. Oh, okay, so I guess go up to where Hal is. Alright. So I guess we're going to battle. Um, if it's like, okay, we're going to get healed up first. Um, if it's like, if it's like the first one, I think How is like your first opponent, and How has two Pokemon at this point, if I remember right. Might just still have the one Pokemon. All right, so. Let's let's have our battle now. So, I still don't know what Pokemon I'd like to fill out my team with. Um, yep, he's got two Pokemon, Pichu and the starter. So, this is just like the first game. So let's go ahead. Hit with a Leafage. Just hit it again. Alright, so that's pretty good right there. We take out the Pichu. We're probably going to end up at level 9 at the end of this battle. Pretty sure. Alright. 
Alright, so, yeah, there's not much uh, this Poplio can even do to our Rallet. So Robin's going to get to level 9, I'm pretty sure. And... And yeah, there it is. If Hala is still the fighting type, um, Kahuna, then Robin would be pretty good for that as well. Alright, Tapu Koko is singing its song of approval. Alright, and we're going to get our Z-move, too. Our Z-ring, that is. We don't get the Z-move until later. Look at that. It's like a redesign. It basically looks the same, but it's black. I wonder... Uh, I'm not sure, like, what... It, I guess just to make it look, you know, cooler, because that's... That's what happens in redesigns a lot, I notice. Alright, so, in my Moon playthrough, I was confused, but that's actually, he's got his thumb like that. See, I re that's something I remember in my Moon playthrough, I was like, why has he got five fingers out? But no, his thumb's not being obstructed by the, the dialogue box, his thumb's right there. That's something that I've noticed. I don't, I'm not sure if anyone remembers me saying that around this point in the Pokemon Moon playthrough, but I just fixed it like a year later, so it, everything works out. We're going to give this challenge a try, so... Ooh. We'll get the nice little, um... Um, pendant. And the first one, if I remember right, the first challenge is normal type challenge. You need to keep your nebby under control. Right, so I guess we go back home and then we could start, you know, actually exploring. What are, what are these two doing? Just chilling out watching? Alright, so we're back home. Okay, so, the next day, is this where I'm, I guess so, because that looks like it would be nighttime. It's nighttime outside, so, go ahead and run outside. Kukui going to let himself, nope, okay. Yep. That looks nice, though, the light at the window. That looks pretty nice. That takes me back to gold and silver. Oh, we got a little money. Thank you, Mom. Okay, so... Let's let's start our adventure. I guess now we can start walking. But I'll end this one here. Um, I think this is pretty decent here. Um, decent length. But if you like this, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe. And I will see you in the next episode of the Ultra Sun. Play through.